about seven years ago, I was looking to do something in our community. I just knew I was kind of at a place where I wasn't feeling fulfilled, so I wanted to find a way, hopefully, to give back. And so I started brainstorming ideas of where I'd like to volunteer, and I looked at a few different places. And either the fit wasn't exactly right, or I couldn't get in my volunteer training hours because I was working full-time in a part-time job. So I got a little frustrated about that and started to write down what I would do if I could do anything. And the book bus came into my mind. And luckily I'm very naive, and I thought, oh, well I can do that, I'll, I'll just do that. So I cashed in my 401k, which was not very sizable, and uh, bought a Volkswagen bus and begged everybody I knew for books and kind of headed out in the community. So, and it's evolved quite a bit since then. This is my new bus. Actually, it's the fourth bus that I've ever had. I've been doing this for about seven years, and this one was actually donated yesterday by Ford. And we're here today at Metropolitan Ministries for Backpacks of Hope which is our final event of the Summer of Good Reads and Good Deeds, which is part of our sponsorship through superpages.com. The inspiration is my grandmother, my Nana Bess. Um, when I was thinking what I could do in the community that might be a good fit, and when I couldn't find that fit, I started to write down what I was good at, what I enjoyed, and what I thought I could give back. And that's when the book bus came into my mind. And so it, was just, it just came to me. So I thought, I have a little cousin who used to call my Nana Nana Bus instead of Nana Bess. So when it came into my mind, I thought, the Nana bus or best, the book bus. Because she always sent me books. When I was little and I lived near her, she'd take me into the downtown area, take me to the library with my mom, and we'd get books and read books together. And when I moved away, she would send me books through her whole life. So as soon as I got this idea in my head, I knew it's best, the book bus. It is probably the most rewarding thing I've ever experienced. It's been such a blessing to me because I get so much from it. I get to see, I've seen kids grow up over seven years now, which is amazing to see. And there's a fallacy in this country that kids are not into reading anymore and I can tell you for a fact I've traveled the entire country this summer and I have not met one kid yet that does not want a book. The most common question I get is when are you coming back or can we have more? <laughs> so yeah it's extremely rewarding.